welcome back to my channel i hope you have a great day if you're new to my channel welcome to the dark side because i'm showing you guys some of my favorite now when i'm talking about cc i'm talking about mod creators like specifically gameplay mods that i have in my game and this is not to leave anyone out or to like i don't know what else people could negatively get from this video but like this is just creators i currently have in my mods folder and they are the ones that i go to all the time when my mods break and I make sure I have their mods in my fucking game. So, okay, now we got that settled. So I wanna go ahead and do this video because I know I've been doing a lot of tutorials recently, especially going back and doing like my old tutorials over. Moving on from that, let's go ahead and jump right in because I know you guys are excited still about these prayers and I have them on my phone because I have the attention span of a goldfish and I tend to not remember shit. So the first creator on my list he is, of course, Kawaii Stacy. Uh, for those of you who do not know, Kawaii Stacy is a mod creator that has broken out into this community. A few of Kawaii Stacy's mods that I need in my game all the time are her slice of life, her education system, so like better schools. So, because for those of you who don't know, like School of the Sims is fucking pointless. Like, I don't know who else needs to, but it's pointless. And you don't learn anything. You just your sim, your teen, your, your children just go there and they come out. But you can do that. You can do that. Like let's go look at her fucking catalog, okay? Now, okay. So the next creator I want to uh, tell you guys about is Sacrificial. For those of you who love torturing your Sims, beating the shit out of them, um, hitting them with all sort of blunt objects or shop objects, depending on that person. I mean, are you a blunt? Or are you a shop objects person? Let me know. Um, is the Extreme Violence mod, and to be honest, Sacrifice does have a huge catalog as well of other mods, however, nothing compares to Extreme Violence, because that's something I always need in my game. Alright, the next creator on my list is a Base Mental, aka Base Mental Drugs, if you guys don't know the drug mod, if you don't know our current virtual drug kingpin is, then, oh, I love, like, you can, you can sell everything, you can smoke, you can, you can do everything, like, that's mainly the only mod Base Mental has, of course, They've like put on gangs and smoking. Um, so but yeah, we 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 these are we these are drugs in our game. Alright, so the next prayer, which really doesn't need an introduction, I mean it's Turbo Driver, Wicked Whims. I mean enough said it's a sex mod. I'm I, there's nothing else. The next creator, um, it's like a duo. It's like Sim Realist and Victor. Uh, for those of you who have not seen my videos on, um, well, my previous video on the new death system. So a lot of serialist mods, which, like, are really, like, functional. I don't know how it goes, but, like, we, the bank system, SNB, SNB Bank, which allows your sims to have their own personal bank accounts. The SNB bills, which allow your sims to actually pay different utility bills. Like, you need to turn your power, you need to turn your garbage, you need to turn on your phone bill. Like, all that shit that you need to pay. Um... And then of course private practice but my current favorite right now is the new death overhaul system you guys did not see that video go watch it uh but yeah those two together oh, chef kiss the next career i want to talk to you guys about is little miss sam little miss sam also has a huge catalog so a lot of my favorite little miss sam mods include no restaurant bills when you get invited for you who don't know if you have dine out if someone asks you to like dinner at a restaurant you're fucking paying why would you pay if they asked you? I don't know. Why was that? Why? So there's a mod to like make them pay if they ask you out. There's also some pregnancy overhaul mods. There is the Sim to dating out. It's like Tinder for the Sims. We love it. And uh, there's, it's just a lot of other little bit sad mods. All right, another creator, which really doesn't do gameplay mods per se. It's just, I need it. And it's a mod and it's not for cast. It's like my over my like my maps my world maps overrides so that's Dura Cheyenne and Noir Sims and they basically make artistic looking maps for your world so if you watch a lot of my videos my live streams and you're always wondering like how destroy worlds look like that it's because I have map overlays and no they don't give you the maps you need to buy the packs that the maps are with the next creator really doesn't need introduction like if you're modding your game these are one of your must have mods and it's where best to ui cheats and also the more columns mod if you're in cast you can have more columns for your cc and if you're in game ui cheats basically turns your entire ui bar into a giant cheat okay so the next one i want to talk about is someone who recently got into the community why am i doing this i have no idea and their name is zero they 
host all this stuff on Patreon. A lot of my mods to fix university features or to like enhance university features videos, I did two of them. All majority came from zero. And one of them was like, you can extend your time in university, your term semester. A big one was having more expensive like tuition. So make sure you guys check out Zero and their whole catalog. The next person is Zerbu. And to be honest, you really can't mix of some certain mods without Zerbu because Zerbu has made the mod constructor program, which allows you to make events, careers, rates out of that. So, like it's an easy, simple tool. Um, and even recently, it's like Hoppy Worlds, like Zerbo is that, Zerbo is that person. The next person, and where did I get into the end of this list? Oh my god. Is Nisa, and she is the current reigning queen for Sims Prostitution. So if you ever heard of Nisa's Wicked Perversions, it's the prostitution mod that looks, that works with wicked whims. I mean, yeah, if you want to be a whole other thought of prostitute in the Sims, you go to Nisa. All right, so the next person I want to talk about is Neil Simming. If you guys don't know who Neil is, Neil made a couple of our staple mods that are currently out of order, like the fairy mod, zombie mod, um, uh, I believe he also made a witch or warlock mod, and also a, a mod that allows you to be a grim reaper. All right, so the last creator I want to talk about, and this is a creator I recently found, maybe like the last two months, is Sui. I can't pronounce their name to save my life, and I'm sorry. They create a very re realistic sugar baby mod, and also a mod that uses actor careers. You can work as like a phone sex operator, I believe it does. But oh, and you can be a cam girl. I based a whole fucking series around this cam girl system because it was that good so yeah that is my current list of mod creators i mean there don't take this the wrong way if your favorite creator is not mentioned because this is what i currently have in my game and through all the other sim updates i mean to be honest some mods get left out it doesn't mean their work isn't exceptional or anything like that it's just no, I'd like to do multiple videos and six months from now the whole list may be different but for right now this is the list I may do one next month I may do one next week with more because I may download more I don't know but yeah that is the end of this video guys I hope you enjoyed it I hope you found some new creators I hope you find some new mods especially if you're new to modding and I will see you guys next time bye bye <laughs>